Hello everyone and welcome back. That last video clip I brought the camera out here about a half hour ago. It is so hot and humid that when you bring the camera from inside the fifth wheel where it's air conditioned and then come out here everything clogs up and you have to let the camera sit for a half hour outside before you can film again. I've had a great few days down here with Melissa. It was really nice to spend some time with her. But tomorrow morning, right when it's starting to get light out, I'm heading back to Minnesota. Like I said in a previous video, this trip down had nothing to do with working on the house. It was just uh, spending some time with Melissa, bringing the high-low trailer down and going camping. So the house is just about exactly how I left it. And uh, eventually, this project will continue. Oh, these chairs right here, antiques. I've been looking forever. Melissa found these. These are the chairs that are going to go with the, the table that I made for the tent. I'm not going to haul them home this time because there's a chance of rain, but this is exactly what I was looking for. She did find this nice vanity for the master bedroom bathroom. And you can't see this one very well, but it matches this one fairly close, not the top but the actual design of it that goes in the uh, hall bathroom. Which there is no hall anymore, but that's kind of what we call this bathroom. So anyway, tomorrow morning before light I'm heading home. I'll be back in Minnesota in two days. I didn't do a video showing the coops down here. This is Oliver Quail, Cartoonix. And it's just about time for them to go out into a bigger cage. And this one here, we've got the rooster, we've got an adult hen, and then we've got those two, and this one here, little hens. On this end, we have some little chicks that she actually hatched this year. They're probably about, I call them half eyes right now. This cage now is empty. And she still has plenty of chickens. I mean, she doesn't have the 150 that she had prior to the flood, but she probably has, I don't know, probably 75. What are you doing, Betty? You getting a drink of water? She did get more bees because the beehive and everything was completely gone. It's been extremely hot, so they usually stay on the outside. Look at that. I mowed the grass. It was like I'm not getting anywhere near this beehive. You being a good girl now, huh? Okay, everyone, well, like I said, it's time to head north. I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, everyone, good morning. Just left Melissa's house. Time to head north. Ninety-five 
45 degrees, and right now I'm about eh, maybe 8 to 10 miles south of Memphis. Well, I just crossed over into Arkansas. Well, it's a couple minutes to one o'clock in the afternoon. I just stopped in Blytheville, Arkansas. I got fuel at uh, the Love's Travel Stop. Got some Chester's chicken for lunch here, and I'm still heading north. Just crossed over into Missouri. Passing over Sykeston, where I stayed last time on my way down. It's 1.55 in the afternoon. Should be hitting St. Louis right about 4 o'clock, always during rush hour. stay in Hannibal but that's a pretty busy town so I'm just gonna go up another 10 miles here and stay in Palmyra. I've been there before. We got the one hotel and it's not too bad. It's not all that much of a room, but this is the exact same room I stayed in before when I brought Max down for his last trip when I brought him down to Louisiana. He stayed in the truck, but this room was available. It's only $50 a night. All I need to do is get a shower and some sleep. I'll see you guys in the morning. to leave Missouri and head into Iowa. Looks like we're going to be going through some rain today too. Just crossed over into Minnesota. Well, I'm getting pretty close to home now, but I've got some guys that are working on a job over here, and uh, since I've been gone for a week, I need to stop and see how they're doing. They're just about finished on it, but just need to check in before I head home. everyone well the long drive is over I'm glad that's done that really takes it out of me thanks a lot for watching I'll see you guys on the next video